Look at the congestion here, guys. So much traffic. I don't know who's operating the signals, but he's making a hash of this. <laughs> yeah. I need to take a look at this, seriously. What is up, guys? Major Magpie here. Welcome back to Cities Skylands. This is my city of Magtropolis. And we're having a little bit of train traffic trouble. Yeah. <laughs> Look at this. Look at all of the trains along there. Yeah, we're going to need more rail lines. We're going to need to think this through a little better. I think. And take a look at it. I didn't actually think when I put them in that traffic trouble would be an issue, but apparently it is. As you can see, I mean. We're only having one train in the cargo at a time, but the cargo is sitting blocking our commuters. Well, this is not good, but look at it, it goes all the way up there. You know, it's all <laughs> it's all the way back here. We've got another one coming in there. They're everywhere. I don't have to queue in the other way as well. Don't seem to be coming out the other end of the tunnel just yet, but this time yet, this time yet. So, we are going to have to take a look at this. Uh, but I'm not going to do it in this episode. Because I would like to buy this tile here. And then just kind of loop cargo back around and onto the line somewhere over here. Um, otherwise, I don't really know what to do with it at the minute. I wouldn't know where to take it. So, we're just going to leave it as is for now. But I'm looking at our demand menu down here. We've got demand for some residential uh, zoning and commercial. None for industrial because we had quite a good episode last episode where we done all of this commercial area here. Uh, industrial area there, sorry. And yeah, we need to try and push for 50,000. If we just jump into our achievements menu. Or our milestones menu, whatever you would like to call it. The next target is to reach 50,000 citizens. We've got 46. We did creep all the way up to about 48,000, but we're steadily just making our way back down. And I think it's just because we're not meeting um, residential demands now. So we can take a look and do something about that in this episode. Um, probably by putting in some nice zoning down here, I think. Let's take a look what we've got we've got nothing zoned in here so let's put some high density residential down here it should get eaten up pretty quickly probably I'll leave that area blank there for now leave that area blank hmm. I want a lot of this to be office space down here, that's the thing. Now let's go ahead and put a little two lane road in behind here. Uh, just with a grass birch, I think. No, we're going to go with trees actually, we'll go with trees. Uh, we want it to be free form, and I'm going to run it a little bit further over out there. Let's try and curve it with the road, like so. so about there. there we, go. we can put some residential on here. So, high density residential, just zoom that in there. Let's just go and zoom that tail there. Make it residential. There we go. A little bit. And boom, straight away, look at houses on here. Lots of hideous looking flats. <laughs> it's only a level one, that's why. Hopefully it'll, uh, it'll increase pretty quickly. Uh, yeah, why not? Go and put another unique build in RCA. Hey, that's a big old beast, isn't it? Doesn't do anything.
quite expensive. Rats and gods. We've got a sh the mall of motivation. Actually, we have we don't have our shopping mall in, so we'll probably go and do that. I'm gonna put it there. Hey, hey, and it's right next door to the transport tower. Look at that, east. Yeah, I want to go and decorate these roundabouts and uh, probably do that off cam uh, very soon. Get them up and run. We've got a few derelict buildings in here, which is no good for us, so let's just get rid of a few of these. Lowers our land value if we leave them in there. Uh, yeah. So we've done the shopping mall. I would like to put in a stadium because I've been wanting to put a stadium in over here for a few episodes now. So why don't we go with a soccer stadium or football? What we've got here, that's the Expo Center. Trade shows and conference attract visitors from the and 4 requirements for building the space elevator. And that's that one, that is a science center. Uh, inside the science center, top notch scientists from all over the world work to find out more about the world we live in. The latest discoveries are presented to visitors and exhibitions, uh, and that, that is a requirement for building the fusion power plant. That. It's an opera house. Not something I want to build in this part of our city. Where's the stadiums in? Must be lack of funds, I kind of find them. What's that? Arena. Ah, here we go. Right, this is what I was after. We've got a medium football stadium. This is what I want to build. And I actually want to put it in here and I want to surround it with a park so I'm gonna go ahead and go boom let's go in there it's not the biggest thing should be able to change the name to FC St Magpie but not mine <laughs> Yeah, look at that. It actually looks a bit tatty in and around here. Never mind. We'll surround it by a park. We'll put in a few trees and a few bits and pieces. Do that off cam because, again, it's going to be tedious. Uh, it is connected to electric and it will have water. Uh, so we've got our football stadium. We now need a cemetery, I think. Yes, because our cemetery is full down here, so we're going to go with a cemetery, a cemetery and we're going to put it probably there, I think. Yeah, I am. I'm going to put it there. Another devil left building. No! I am suffering a little bit. Yeah, our industrial estate just isn't doing that well. <laughs> yeah, it's because we need residents. We need loads and loads of residents. Let's go ahead and zone all of this area here with some high density residential. Just off the roundabout. So we'll go in here, all of this. 
all residential in the back of there as well. For all of that. We might as well do everything ar around here. Like so. Yeah, we're slowly but surely getting nicely developed. Look at all of these posh little buildings. They're level two offices. Seem to be doing alright next to this um, highway. Let's get rid of you. Okay, what we could go ahead and do, actually, is probably start thinking about changing this road here. Because I would like to run that, take away all of this bit from here, and run that around and in this part of our city here. Just make, it'll make it a lot more accessible. But, first of all, we need to make sure that these are empty. Building is empty and it's taken forever. And the cemetery is not empty. Empty building to another facility. It's kind of in the way there. We need to put in a lot more residents, don't we? What we can do, actually. Yeah. I've had, I've had a thought. I've had a thought. Right. I was thinking the other day, right? We've got lots of industrial in terms of, you know, like just raw polluting. We've got oil zoning over here. And over there, we had some in Oil Valley, which was over here. Uh, but we've never actually had just farming. Thought we could probably go ahead and just put a few rows of just farming industrial along here. It's not going to pollute anything. And it'll look a little different for our city. So let's do that now. We're going to go four lane with trees in the centre. And free form. And I'm just going to run it. As close to this as I can get it. About there. To there. there. Right, I'm going to stop that there and then I want to put another row directly behind it. Nope. Come on. That's too close. Run that to there. There we go. Right, and this is all going to be um, industrial falling. So let's just connect these up. There we go. And the same on this side. Leaving like that for now. I want to go ahead and dezone this bit here. So everything on that roundabout is gone. Bam, bam, bam. All of this is gone. I'll get rid of you as well. We then want to go ahead and remove this road. Is there still this traffic lights on here? Why is the traffic lights on here? Let's toggle them off. Come on. 
So I'm going to stay as well. This is not good. I do not like the traffic lights. The traffic lights are like sitting really up. Come on. Just drive. You can drive. A little bit of traffic there. Let's just remove them off there. <laughs> just remove the traffic lights and it just becomes total chaos. <laughs> oh, I wanted to connect this up, don't we? Let's, just for now, we're just going to go four lane, just a normal. I'm just going to connect it. And... On here, like that. Right. We want to toggle them lights off there and off there. No lights. Now I'm going to go ahead and zone. We're going to go ahead and we're going to paint a district. So let's paint this here. Oh. I'm going to do that. No mind. And um, how do you remove that one? And it destructs it. Oh, look at that for a work of art. <laughs> Oops, might have gone a bit OTT. Right, there we go. Paint that. While I'm in here, let's just expand uh, downtown Manhattan as well. So, all of this. And everything up to the edge of this. Oh, that's what I'm doing. Let's just try that again. Um, this can all be downtown Manhattan. Probably to probably all of this, including the marina. So up to this roundabout will do. Uh, include all of this. Just paint everything in here. There we go. That's one big ass district. That. <laughs> Just include these. Make sure nobody's left out. I think that covers everything, doesn't it? Yep. Right. Back to Briarwood Heights. This is just going to be... Um, how do you do... Toggle zone in there. Uh, wait there. Let's jump back into our District 2. Ah, right there, we've got farming. So, only farming industry. That. Generic and removes the specialization. Select this and then returns it. Ah, right, okay. And that one is all industry and that one is forestry. Okay, so we just want farming on Briarwood Heights. Now we are going to go ahead and just zone all of that. Just paint all of this industrial. I've actually got no demand for this, so I'm not sure if it's going to take off straight away. But I was kind of hoping that the fact that we grow our own products would help out our shops for whatever products there is there selling. I'm guessing there's a lot of food industry related shops that are struggling because they keep closing down or getting made um, derelict basically. But a lot of them over next to our Statue of Liberty. So. Right, so that's that done. See how that develops. Let's just go ahead and clean up this area here. Oh, it's getting ready to use. Another building. 
That's everybody from there. No toilet from there. Yep. Boom. Get out. Struggling in the street. I did want to try and get some sort of route in here, but that's going to have to wait until we move uh, these guys. And in the meantime, actually, it might be a better idea to get something a bit more substantial than this roundabout here for access to this part of the city. Because as soon as we remove this road from here, uh, our traffic is no longer going to be using this to get into this part of the city. They're going to start using this. And I'm not so sure that this pretty little roundabout here is going to cope with the huge demand. But, I mean, time will tell. We will see. That's crime is an issue with the marina. It's not exactly hard to get to, is it? Don't know where the police are, then. Never mind. Anyways, guys, let's go ahead and leave this episode here. Um, it's been alright. It's been okay. We need to try and figure out something to do with the dead. Yeah, I mean... We built this beautiful little gem. I mean, look at that. Yeah. I like the graffiti on the wall there. That's cool. Anyways, guys... Until the next one, thanks a lot for watching.